This is my mom's puppy leg girl. Hi, is that okay? Hi, he doesn't want to be up here, but this is my mom's puppy Laker. This is my brother. Say hi to the people. Oh, there he is. Hi. Who is that? Oh, maybe he's a little camera shy, but this is, oh, it's okay. Is that okay? He gets very dramatic and very upset. Say hi. Hey guys, I wanted to do, well, you can tell by the name, name, title of this video. Um, I'm here at my mom's house visiting, so I just wanted to kind of like get ready and film it. I don't know why. I haven't done a tutorial in so long, but I thought it would be kind of fun to just do like a get ready with me. It's more just going to be like one eye and lipstick and highlighter. But anyhow, it's a voiceover because my sister's here and we're talking and catching up. So it is a voiceover. Maybe I'll do a speed up or I'll do real time. I don't really know. But if you guys want to see how to get this look, it's nothing fancy, but I just thought I'd get ready and film it. <laughs> you know, if you guys want to see that, then keep watching. So I am starting with my Coastal Sense Reveal 2 palette. You guys know I'm obsessed with this palette. I'm starting with those two colors mixed together with my sponge tip applicator. Do not judge. I love my sponge tip applicator. I use them. I always will. Don't judge. <laughs> so I blend those two colors together all over my eyelid from eyelash to eyebrow. And then I go in with this color here and a Sigma brush. I'm not sure the number of it. I'll have it all listed down below. And I just blend that in the outer corner, blend it in. Blending, more blending, and more blending. Looking like a crazy little Energizer Bunny because she's psychotically blending. <laughs> then I'm taking this color as well. You'll see, notice, same Sigma brush. <laughs> you know, I'm just no professional. I'm just like, hey, one brush is good. That's all I brought with me, so that's what we're going to use. This color next, again, the outer corner blended in. I love this color. Love it. Pretty much kind of obsessed. It's just such a pretty color. And then my Jordana Fabu liner. And uh, there we go. She's showing you. She, me. <laughs> and I'm going to draw a wing. And uh, that's always just like rocket science for me. It's very difficult, but I try. So just quickly drawing that wing on, which in real time probably takes like 10 minutes. <laughs> no joke, unless I'm having troubles, um, but I didn't. So now I'm going to curl my lashes and apply my Essence Mascara. And like I said, I'm talking to my sister visiting. So then I take that color there with my pencil brush and I'm going to apply that um, on the lower lash line. Then taking this lighter color here and just applying that in the inner corner of my eye to about halfway just to help open up my eyes. Next, applying mascara to my lower lash line. I just kind of pat it out so it doesn't get any on my cheeks. Then I'm taking that light color from my Ofra highlighter, which I'm so obsessed with, and just applying that to the inner uh, corners of my eye, tear duct area, to really open it up and... Make me look frosty, frost. Then I'm applying, oh, that's such a nasty, ooh, little, that nasty glue. And my wispies, applying my falsies. Good times. Then I'm using my current favorite blush by NYX. I'm so obsessed, my Real Techniques. I think it's their all-purpose blush brush. I'm so obsessed with this blush right now, like, legit. Then again, another new obsession is this Ofra highlighter. If you guys saw my May favorites, you saw both of these things being featured in it, but look at that Ofra highlighter. It is just ridiculous. It is so amazing, like, oh, so awesome. Then just recurling my lashes, just to seal in everything, attach the falsies to the other, the others, my real ones. Then I'm taking that lighter color in the highlighter and just applying that to my brow bone and the inner corners and about halfway to my the tops of my lids.
Then I'm using this It Cosmetics Bye Bye Pores Powder, another new favorite obsession. I got this at Gen Beauty and oh my god, I am seriously obsessed. It makes my skin look like it has a filter. And we all know I do not have good skin, but it makes me look like it's at least halfway um, decent. Jordana Lip Liner. I'm going to be using... Oh, the deek deek! Jordana Lip Liner in 20. Mm -hmm. It's very harsh for me to do my lip liner because I have, I have really crooked lips. So... You know, I have to overdraw them and try and even them out, and it's just very difficult. So, yeah. And I overdraw my lips, too. Bounce. Then, Soar by MAC. like my cockatiel. It's kind of like that, just to like shade it up. I don't know. Then Pretty in Pink by NYX. And soft pink. It just kind of lightens it up, as you can tell. BG by Jar Cosmetics. Brain farts. So that's it guys that was my kind of get ready with me if you guys like these kind of videos give it a thumbs up or leave it in the comments below if you guys want me to keep doing these kind of videos or like get ready with me chit chats if you guys want that leave it in the comments down below and I guess that's it um I've just been I got ready with me with like kind of like my current favorites the things that I've been really loving which is like the coastal sense reach Coastal Scent Reveal 2 palette, that Ofra highlighter though, and I mean you guys saw it, but those are like, if you saw my May favorites, you guys know that these are colors that I'm loving and I'm wearing quite a bit. <sighs> That's it. I hope you guys are having a great day. Please be kind to each other always, and I will see you in another video soon.